Hi, it's Corrine for Wild Orchid Crafts, and today I'd like to share with you this shadow box that I altered. This was an 8x10 shadow box that I got from Hobby Lobby, and I was going to paint it, but I, I was so happy, I was going to put some white over it, but I was really happy with the color, so I left it as it is, and I'm sorry, I'm trying not to get a glare for you. I added a 4x4 photo inside, and some ribbon from Hobby Lobby and the trim that is in the middle I will put a link to that and all the other products here that I'm using I do have a full start to finish on this if you'd like to watch that then stay tuned and um, let me just quickly go over some of the products that I used and also on the bottom of this I used a candlestick from the dollar store and edit adhered it with a little bit of E6000 and hot glue so I also have some detailed photos of this project, so just quickly if I can go over what I used. I used one of the Baby Pink Center Wild Rose 30mm, these are QVR026. I used a couple of the Set A of the Mixed Pastel Tone Chrysanthemums and these are QVR023. These are my favorites. I'm placing another order. Um, to order more of these because I just don't want to run out but I have been using them a ton and I've only used two out of this package so I still have a full package and as you can see I still have quite a few in this one and I use them a lot so they really do go a long way 50 come in a pack so these are the mixed pastel tone chrysanthemums and this is set C QVR 031 again all of this information will be in the description box as well I used six of the hip rosebuds these are GST 014 I used some stamens again those will be linked and I also used the mixed pastel color tulip this is MKX 212 and then I used um, the last one of these I believe I might have more but I used the last one from this package the trellis roses in ivory and it's MKX 682. So if you have any questions please leave me a comment and I hope you enjoyed the start to finish on this. Check out the description box for all the links to Wild Orchid Crafts. There's so many amazing designers and amazing um, products that they that they showcase so I hope you check out the blog and also the YouTube and all the links will be in the description box. Thanks so much for watching. Mm -hmm.